Hello, my name is Chad Lehman, and this is a presentation on the Learning Styles Inventory, available in Career Cruising. When clicking on a link for Career Cruising in Moodle, you'll be taken to the Career Cruising homepage, like you see here. To navigate in Career Cruising, use the top menu bar. The Assessments menu option has multiple assessments that will help you gain a better understanding of yourself. The third assessment, the Learning Styles Inventory, is the assessment we're currently looking for. You will discover how you learn and retain information and find tips on how to improve your study habits to suit your learning style. You'll be asked to enter your first and last name. You can enter your initials if you prefer. You'll first be given an introduction about learning styles. When taking assessments, it's important to note there is no right or wrong answer. The questions are about you and what you prefer. Answer honestly and choose the option that best fits you. When you are ready to begin the assessment, click Start Now. In total, you will be asked 20 questions. Again, answer with the option that best fits you. When you complete the assessment, you will be asked if you want to save your results to your portfolio. If you say yes, you will keep your results in Career Cruising to review in the future, but you have to make a free account. If you do make an account, I recommend using your email address so you won't forget your login information. I'm going to say no for now. The assessment will tell you what type of learning style do you prefer. Visual, learning by seeing. Auditory, learning by hearing or tactile, also sometimes known as motor learning, or learning by doing. The assessment will tell you which way you often learn best and give you some tips to better learn new topics. This will help you as you go through your time at Neil Squire Society and later on in life. Make sure you make a note of what is your preferred learning style. This concludes our presentation on learning styles. If you have any questions about this presentation, please do not hesitate to ask your assigned facilitator.